Lance and I met probably between the age of 13 and 14 for the first time at secondary school. After passing each other by for the first few years, only being able to see and hear him, loud he still always, of course, we grew a friendship. It wasn't long before the year, real teenage years kicked in, sneaking out on a Friday night for a bottle of Frosty Jacks or whatever we could get our hands on. Lance being Lance, always the loudest and proudest of the bunch, with a joke and a story to tell. To round off Lance's years as a single man, we jetted off to Budapest last month for a free night break. The trip was spent laughing, joking, sharing stories, and of course Lance enjoying a karaoke rendition of Meatloaf. But Lance being Lance, took every selfie and photo in his stride, sharing jokes with foreign strangers. That's why we love him to bits, and that's why Rebecca has fell in love with him, because he's a fantastic guy. All in all, I stand here beside him today, proud to have him as a friend, and honoured to stand and speak on such a special day for him and Rebecca. In life we have plenty of friends, we can count on one hand the number of friends we can rely on. And I know, and I hope he knows, that I'm always there for him, and now Rebecca. And I'm delighted they found each other, and I'm sure they'll spend an eternity of making happy memories together. Is there in the I want everyone here to know how lucky I feel to be here right now. Rebecca, I love you in so many ways and for so many reasons. You know me and understand me like no one else ever could. You believe in my dreams and care about my feelings. You make me laugh and smile so often. You have a way of bringing out the very best in me, but mostly because you're my very best friend, my soulmate. I love you with all my heart. Thank you for marrying me and making me the happiest man alive and for loving me as much as I love you.